partner. This is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown? What are you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now, you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. Really? Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? The other one has been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Clearly you've recovered from your bear encounter. Could have played that better, couldn't you? That's all you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Hosea. That feller's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. Must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. You see anyone? Nope. Okay. I reckon we could do it now. Sneak in, I'll get the coach. You can try the house. Or wait until morning when I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show. 
Well, you sneak into the house, find what you can, and then get the stagecoach. What do you think? Just wait. Okay. <laughs> Let's get on with this, Mr. Uh, Morgan. Yes. <clears throat> Let me head up there and make a fool of myself. <laughs> with pleasure. Just don't get caught. Because it's me, they'll shoot first. <clears throat> Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. with Junior here. You selling something, partner? I'm not selling, sir. I'm giving it away. <laughs> I was just telling uh, uh, your, uh, Junior, what's your name, son? Robert Crawford III, sir. Ship. Oh, pleasure to meet you. Both of you, uh, My name... My name is... Now, don't tell no one, because in New York, I'm kind of famous. I want to perform on Broadway. Now that's not important or relevant. I have been saved! I have been found! Oh, no, I, I have thought in your eyes you think I'm a nut. You think I'm a nut, Bob Crawford III? I'm not interested in no religious talk. I'm not a religious man. Respects them as has it, but I got something better. Way better than church. Why should you? Please! Final! Alignment. What? Final alignment. The Lord God Almighty, or whoever built it, put our brains in here, but our soul is in our back. You, sir, your, your back looks kind of tricky. Sure. Back looks bad for you. Just 10 or 15 veterans. Whiskey suits me fine, sir. Whiskey, whiskey is just causing the problem. Women adore me. I got it. Is that better? Just a bit. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a little bit better. This session has been free but perhaps I might call it again. How much will it cost me? I'm offering you virility and you're asking me about money, sir. I ain't made of money, Mr. Myrix. A reasonable. Have a think about it. I'll be around this way next.
You done, Arthur? Yep. Okay, let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. these little trinkets for people from animal claws, teeth, and uh, such like. What are you doing? Get back on the road. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Nah, I'll catch up with you later. Okay. Stay out of trouble. <laughs> 